So, the next thing to happen on AEW Dynamite, we get to the next match of the night. It was Wardlow versus a local competitor. I forgot what was his name. I'll probably have his name in the title. Uh, Barrett Brown or Barrett something. So, yeah, um, you know, that guy was getting beat the hell off by L Wardlow. And Adam Cole was on commentary for this match. Wardlow toss, uh, carried him to the corner, picks him up, and sets him up on the top turnbuckle, dropping him fa uh, face first into his knee. And then Wardlow starts looking at the big screen and starts flexing and stuff, you know, doing all that stuff. And then he looks at the guy again, picks him up, and then hits the spin and smooth that power bomb or the last ride pretty much. And he pinned him for the three count. So, yeah, Wardlow defeated uh, that local competitor tonight in a one-on-one -on -one match. That's what happened. Wardlow showing his dominance and all that stuff. And, yeah. That's what happened there. For that match, I'll give it a half of a star. That's why I'll give it. But, yeah, still pretty good with uh, Warlow showing all his stuff. But at this point, like, you know, if he's going to go for the world title and stuff, like they've been saying, like, he needs to face, like, more actual challengers, you know. And that's what they need to do. Like, they need to get past that stupid crap. But other than that, you know, Warlow's still doing good. But, yeah, that's what happened there. But yeah, up next we're going to be seeing Adam Copeland versus Daniel Garcia one-on-one -on -one in a number one contenders match up next on Dynamite. There's still more matches to come tonight. So yeah, I'll see you guys later until the next thing that happens on AEW Dynamite. See you guys later. Until then.